Hey, I'm Ferrari St. Paul with the University TV here at Dominican University, a Catholic institution sponsored by the Cincinnati Dominican Sisters. Let's go, come on! Dominican University is located in River Forest, Illinois, 10 miles west of downtown Chicago and a short ride on the L to the Loop. DU neighbors Oak Park, which is famous for Frank Lloyd Wright and his beautifully designed prairie-style homes. On Lake Street, there's uh, just down the street from here, there's a dozen little shops, as we call it, downtown Oak Park, and it has like almost everything you could ask for, coffee shops, restaurants, there's um, a movie theater. Downtown Chicago is only about a 15-minute drive from here. DU's campus sits on 30 acres of wooded land and features Gothic architecture. On DU's campus, there are opportunities around every corner. <laughs> With Chicago just a few minutes away, you may find yourself craving some culture, which you can find right here in Dominican University's Performing Arts Center. You don't even have to be a theater major in order to contribute to the arts. Whether you want to work in the box office, help build scenery, design costumes, or perform on stage. This is perfect. It's all here for you. There are 3,400 students enrolled at Dominican University. There is one faculty member for every 12 students and most classes average about 16. We have a very strong spiritual dimension. We're very ecumenical. We're very embracing. There are faculty and students here from all faiths and all persuasions. However, our Dominican tradition is the core value at this school and it's a very positive thing because it is an embracing tradition that welcomes everyone in terms of all of the diversity that I've been talking about. All students will pay an annual tuition of about $24,000 and room and board is about an additional $8,000. On the plus side, around 75% of incoming freshmen receive some form of financial aid. Dominican University has more than 50 majors and programs for undergraduates and students can form their own major with the guidance of faculty members. All of the research that we do in the lab is fueled by undergraduates. Uh, we have undergraduates that work through the semester and throughout the summer that get uh, roll up their sleeves and get involved in the research and uh, end up presenting at conferences. Uh, right here we have a setup of an Aplesia Californica, that's a sea slug, and we're set up to be able to record from the nervous system while we're actually teaching the animal something new. Uh, so we've got the uh, nervous system exposed and we're about to place some electrodes to actually record the nervous system uh, activity that's ongoing. DU is one of the first universities in the country to establish a study abroad program. As early as 1925, students have had the chance to experience foreign soil stretching from London to South Africa. Thinking about what to major in at Dominican University? Why not wrap your brain around this new major? Neuroscience. You can study the chemical makeup of the brain and see what's really going on up here. Even earn your Master's of Business degree in just five years through the Brennan School of Business. There are 137 full-time professors at Dominican University. 84% hold the highest educational degree in their area of study, and a majority have the highest degree in their field of scholarship. The Dominican Stars compete in the NCAA Division III and have a strong soccer team among their collegiate sports. Approximately one-third of the student-athletes at DU were named Scholar-Athletes by the Northern Athletics Conference. At Dominican University, there are five residence halls, plus off-campus accommodations in neighboring Oak Park. When I came here, I was in Coghlan, which is probably the best dorm for a freshman to be in. Centennial is air-conditioned, but uh, Coghlan, it's, it's so much more of a community. Everyone leaves their doors open. Everyone talks to each other. People walk across the hall and watching movies. We share food. The RAs were, were wonderful. They were the nicest people and they, were, they helped immensely just me adjusting to a larger community. Dominican offers a rich and diverse student life with more than 50 student organizations and even programming tailored just for commuter students. There are leadership education and development programs, 16 honor societies, community service opportunities, local and global alternative spring breaks, intramural sports, and academic groups. There's a great social life. You know, I believe, because I've been advising for 14 years, I believe in a balanced approach. You've got to have academics, you've got to have the social life. The internships are endless. We have a great internship office through our career development, and they offer internships at most of the Fortune 500 companies, but also at some of the smaller places. Our students who are educators, they go into both public and private schools to do their student teaching, you know. And then we have students who just stay right here in River Forest, and they find internships locally 
believe. What's your major? Psychology and addiction counseling. Oh, very cool. And what kind of cool stuff have you done with that? Any research projects, internships, study abroad? All that. I did um, an internship last semester at uh, Gateway Foundation. It's on the west side of Chicago, and it's a um, drug and alcohol treatment center, so it's inpatient. And now I'm doing an internship with Chicago Recovery Alliance, which is a needle exchange around the city of Chicago, and they have a van that goes around to all the areas that need it. So I did an internship, um, and then last year I did study abroad in Oxford, and I studied uh, philosophy and theology. Want to know what makes the mind tick and the heart beat a little faster? Maybe you're aching to be a neuroscientist or a successful business person. Whatever your passion, Dominican University may be your ticket. Well, I don't know about you, but after that busy day, I'm ready for a nap. So I'm Ferrari St. Paul, and I'll see you later.